Hey guys, this is Seth SU Fly Fishing. We are doing some fishing today in a mountain stream because we had a low pressure system come in. We had some uh, cooler temps with a high only in the mid 70s and we actually had some lows dropping into the 50s. Um, and we also got some rain. Um, it was like 0.3.4 inches, but with the lower temps and the rain and it being, you know, and that water cooling off quite a bit, I decided to go to one of my freestone streams I usually fish. We did pretty good. In fact, um, the traditional up and down that I usually do with your streamer didn't seem to get any bites. So I just took my 10 foot, uh, 10 inch two weight and started throwing streamers just tradition, like a traditional, just casting them out there and stripping them in, bouncing them off the bottom. And wouldn't you know, that's what they preferred. Um, so uh, we did really good with streamers. We caught some on bugs and um, we waited for the afternoon thunderstorm that was supposed to come and drop like a half inch of water. Um, it didn't come. However, we still still got, got some good fish. We still had a good time. We still caught um, we still caught rainbows and brookies. No browns this time, which is um, you know usually I get one or two browns here, but it is what it is. So I hope y'all enjoy, and I'll be back here after the fishing's done. I started the day at the dam uh, just to get a few fish and uh, get the skunk out of the boat. Uh, nothing real big, just a few uh, little par marks here and there. Um, I was expecting maybe one big fish, like right at the dam, but it just didn't happen. So a uh, few little fish here, a few little fish there, and then we moved on up top um, above the dam and started throwing streamers around. There we go. Come here, buddy. There he goes. There we go. Streamer eat. Little one, but hey, it's a streamer eat. There it goes. There we go. Nice wild rainbow. Pretty wild rainbow, all colored up. Pretty fish, oh, there he goes. That's the first like 12 inch fish I've caught today. Let me start using my net more. Put my net on the side. There we go. Better fish. What is this? Is this a brookie? Or brown? I think this is a brown. No, it's just a brookie. Little brookie. 
Definitely a stalker. <sighs> Here we go. Oh, there he goes. There we go. Decent fish. Pretty. There we go. There we go. Another one. It's another brook trout. <clears throat> Pretty fish. Gee, a lot of this holdover brookies made it up this far. Here we go. No rainbow. Freaking little torp. Oh. Pretty. Here we go. There it goes, a little holdover fish. Hmm. There we go. Hmm. That's a little wild fish. Oh, and he's gone. Alright, I've been talking much today. So, it's been interesting. It's Nothing's going the way... I Nothing's going the way I thought it would. I thought I'd get up here and the fish would be, the water would be dirty and the fish would be very hungry and the fish are eating fine. I mean, it's nothing, it's, it's normal. Um, however, nothing big. Uh, I've, I've caught a few good ones, um, had a few good wild ones, a few good brookies and stuff. 
but nothing like just massive. And that's what I kind of came here today for, was to go after like a big brown and There we go. There's another one. That is a, I want to say a wild bow. Angry, 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 angry. No, that's a, that's a holdover fish. Um, there we go. Little wild rainbow. Okay. So. Little rainbow. All right. So I lost my last um, poacher. That was and that was the stream that was working really well. So I'm gonna. I only tied up three of them, but I lost two right off the bat, like a dingus. So. We're going nymphs and we'll rotate in between streamers to see if anything is uh anything else is eating here we go it's better fish i say better fish it's because i've all been catching it's like five and six inches here in the end of the day this makes number 40. One, 41. Just shook off. It's been so slow. So this is just a little size 20 waltz worm. Um, it's not very big, it's just some uh, hairs uh some hairs here like mask uh fur dubbing um wrapped on to a size 20 hook with a size 2.5 uh silver slotted tungsten bead and a little um fluorescent orange or fire orange um collar it's one of my favorite little um flies like waltz worm patterns that you just it seems to work with real picky fish and whenever you got picky fish size down so the day ended up um like i said i, I still caught like 40 something fish I'm, I'm i'm happy with it um the rain never came and then the temperature got above 65 and i was like all right i'm out i'm done and i left um i only fished about an hour and a half after lunch which I took and uh, around uh, from like 12 to 1. It was like 1.30 by the time I got back to the water. And it was just, I was just waiting for that thunderstorm that they said was going to come. And weatherman, I guess, got it wrong. Just ne It just never came. So, rained all around me. Just not on that river. But um, right now, uh, we're, about, we're expecting some pretty heavy rain for next week. Um, so, uh, which would be this week when this movie, when this video comes out, we've got a tropical depression coming up and it's projected to go up the East coast. So what we're going to do is probably next week after this rain, we're going to go up to mountains to one of my favorite bodies of water. It's a real high gradient free stone, uh, free stone stream. And the water seems to, um, hold some pretty good fish. And we're going to go after a stereotypically big fish for this water. Um, throw some streamers around, try to get something between 18 to 20 inches wild fish. And if we get it, yay! If not, I'll probably still catch a bunch of fish. So, hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you have any questions or statements, please, comments below. If you want to see more, subscribe, and a thumbs up always helps me out. Uh, hope y'all enjoyed this. Tight lines, blessings, and I'll see you in the next one.